Can you talk about your channel expansion plans and which new countries you plan to enter? So we have a very strong presence in NPGCC, yeah, for the matter UAE, Oman, Bahrain, Qatar, Saudi. And uh, there are two, three other markets which we identify, Egypt being one of them, which is a very big market. So currently we are in a phase of doing market analysis, market study, although we are getting a lot of inquiries on those markets. So Egypt looks quite promising and we are wanting to see how we can grow up in that market as well. What are the major initiatives taken this JITEX? So if you see, apart from the, uh, the demonstrations where we are showcasing our new release, we have created something called as a business box office, right? In most of the box office, you see movies and everything. So we create a concept where we say, okay, on an hourly basis, we have different shows running around and we are inviting prominent uh, speakers from the industry. And uh, after this, there is an event happening from the ex-ICI chairman. He is going to talk on uh, corporate tax. Then there are business setup, there are marketing. So uh, whatever is needed for a small and medium business to function, we are going to cover all those things in five days. And we would invite the visitors to come and have a look at it and learn from them from it. How has the market changed with the introduction of taxes in the region? So, uh, as we all know, VAT was introduced in 2018 uh, in And it was a much needed move for the economy, to boost the economy. And it's almost, the, this is the fifth year going, and we're only seeing growth happening, even for the businesses, right? They have become more compliant, and uh, they're able to cater to the needs of even though taxes have been introduced, it is one of the lowest in the in the world, we can say. So the overall economy has definitely been boosted because of the income which is coming up and you know, the reinvestment is happening in the ecosystem. What are you introducing at JITEX this year? So this year, uh, we are introducing our new release, which is release 4.0. And uh, we are looking at a four-dimensional growth for businesses. When I say release 4.0 linked to four dimension growth, most of the businesses have, are working on four pillars. You know, when I make a statement of four pillars, one is to do with managing the entire business management, so accounts, inventory, payroll, compliance, everything. Compliance is one of the important pillars. So tally, as I, I was just mentioning, or tally takes of the entire compliance required for entire GCC, not only limiting to UAE VAT, but you VAT been introduced in Oman, Bahrain, and Saudi definitely. Saudi has introduced the invoicing so we fulfill. So we require one software which will take care of the entire compliance scenario. Uh, the new release also brings in seamless communication. So today businesses are requiring to do a seamless communication with their customers, suppliers. So we already had a lot of features called uh, uh, the SMS and the emails. Now in this new release, WhatsApp is integrated seamlessly. We got dashboards which will help business owners to make you know insight, insightful decisions. Not only business owners, if you are a finance manager, you can create your own dashboard. On a one screen, you'll be able to take decisions, see whatever reports you want to see. So yeah, and we are really excited. The response will be really very good. How has been the response from channel partners? We have uh, a good uh, channel established here. However, uh, having said this, we are looking at uh, new partners in uh, different GCC countries as well. And from morning onwards, the response will be really good. We are getting a lot of inquiries from different Middle East countries. And, uh, they are also exploring strategic alliances. How do you support your channel partners? So ideally, uh, as I told, our channel partner program is very simple. We don't look at doing primary billing. That's not the concept that we look at. Uh, we work hand in hand with them, wherein we help them to acquire customers. Right? So whatever is required for my channel partner to grow his business, to acquire customers, I am with him in all the instances. So ours is, as I told, ours is a different model where we don't believe in doing uh, primary sales or only billing to them. Our intention is to ensure that their business grows because we are a 100% indirect organization. We don't sell directly. So if my channel partner grows, I will definitely grow. In such a competitive market, how do you ensure partners maintain decent margins? Uh, see, what happens is, as I told, it's a huge market, right? And uh, predominantly UAE, I think around 350 to 400,000 businesses are that registered. We have a good opportunity to service all of them. Right? And uh, today, it's one of the major markets which is completely digitized. People are moving to a digital. People are understanding the value of managing books of accounts properly and through some through system. So we have a huge market to cater and to huge businesses to assist. So there's a good potential and we are sure we'll definitely go ahead and my partners will also be able to service all these customers. What are your expectations from JITEX this year? Year on year it is going yeah. and uh, this is the ninth year that we are simultaneously present here and we are there with a big bang and 
the response so far on the first day has been tremendous and we're expecting will grow from here definitely how do you see the market for you in the middle east we are one of the dominant players okay. right and uh, if i talk about in terms of uh, we have about 67000 businesses who are using tally uh, yeah who are using using tally so that itself states what we are in this market